So this morning too, autonomous sail drone explorers will launch from Jacksonville. This is pretty cool. In partnership with the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or as most of us call it, NOAA, sail drone will go storm chasing in the Atlantic. This is Jack's reporter, Zach Lajway, trying to get a spot on one of those drones, but it sounds like they're keeping them on the shore. Still a good view for you, Zach. Absolutely, Vic. You know, oftentimes when we talk about drones, we're talking about drones we see or hear flying around in the air. Well, today we're talking about drones out on the water. These two sea drones behind me, they will embark on a three-month journey. They're going to travel inside hurricanes, collecting data, which, as you mentioned, is a first. A bright orange spot in an ocean of blue. California-based sail drone has a fleet of uncrewed sailing vehicles, or USVs, like this. They're designed with a tall, hard wing to stand up to high wind conditions. This is video of the company testing one in San Francisco Bay. To better understand the rapid intensification of severe weather systems, sail drone is deploying five USVs to study storms. Their goal, to collect data where it's never been collected before, the eye of a storm. These USVs are highly maneuverable wind and solar powered vehicles designed for long range data collection missions. Sail drone USVs are the only autonomous vehicle that can collect meteorological and environmental data above and below the sea surface and withstand extreme winds during a hurricane. NOAA is predicting a 60% chance the 2021 Atlantic hurricane season will be above normal with 13 to 20 named storms. Half are expected to become hurricanes. Three to five are expected to be major hurricanes. A cat three or higher. In total, five drones will launch today. Three from the Virgin Islands, two right here from Jacksonville. We, of course, will continue to update you throughout the day right here on News for Jax. Reporting live in Jacksonville, I'm Zach Lajway, Channel 4, The Local Station.